Did you know coffee doesn't actually give you energy at all? It's using the same neurochemical hijacking technique studied in military sleep deprivation research. Coffee blocks adenosine receptors in your brain that signal tiredness. Adenosine naturally builds up during wakefulness to trigger sleep, but caffeine molecules physically occupy these receptors for six to eight hours. Military studies use controlled adenosine blocking to extend combat alertness during 72-hour operations. The problem is, this creates artificial alertness suppression, not real energy. That's why veteran-owned coffee operations understand the difference. Quality coffee provides sustained performance rather than temporary receptor blocking that leads to crashes. Real energy comes from understanding how your body actually works, not just masking fatigue. The military taught us the difference between being alert and being truly ready.